Hi, my name is Surya and I'm demoing the OB maps here in the SE 2010. So we had a lot many visitors to the map stand and they were quite happy with the new features that OB maps have. One of the real crowd pleasers here was the ability for public transport layers which you can see here on the map. For example, so and the fact that we also show all the different all the different uh, public transport layers and when you focus on them then you can see also look find the diff various tram and bus numbers that you have so that was a huge hit and obviously drive and walk navigation is a real crowd pleaser and something that a lot of people were quite excited to know about was also the the power of Kobe Maps when it is working offline. The fact that we can download maps quite easily uh, and to our phone and then use it offline is always something that people are very impressed about. They, of course, they loved the pinch and zoom that we currently have on our map. Yeah. Yeah. So that's that's something that they really like and. Now, search have so many categories on OV maps that people are quite impressed. So these, all these categories help you to also use your OV maps to your full extent, even if you're offline, so that there won't be any data charges for you. So, for example, if you, okay, now it's searching online because I'm connected online, but yeah, you will also find the places which are kind of close to you and which are walkable which are in a walkable distance, which is quite useful if you are a tourist who is on foot walking around. And also, if I go to um, if I go to favorites, so another thing that I can do is um, yeah, I I go to my I I go and I add the different waypoints and. Once I mark them as a favorite and I can go here and all my routes are added here and yeah most of them are places to eat anyways and also the different places my different favorites are here so this is really useful because if i log in into any form with but with via ov maps and then i just need to press the sync button which uh, and then it syncs with just one click and all my routes are already into the map into my mobile phone or all the places which i favorited are onto my maps.ov.com so that was again something that a lot of people were very happy to know about and yeah so i think that was probably the highlights that we had we couldn't really demo the live traffic flow here because a lot Amsterdam doesn't have it yet but a lot of people were quite impressed with that in London and they really remembered about it and they talked about it quite a bit. Yeah.